Time now is 517. Looking outside, sunrise still more than two hours away, so it's dark outside in Tallahassee. You see some stars out there. Clear skies after yesterday's cold front has brought some cool dry air and some cold dry air. It's 31 degrees. You might have some frost to scrape this morning. Looking at a dry, sunny afternoon, though. These cool temperatures are not here to stay. We are warming up for the next few days. You'll see that in your extended forecast. Winds mostly calm. A lot of zeros on this map. And what does that mean? Well, aside from the quiet weather, that means that you have better potential for frost where you see those zeros. You need air close to saturation temperatures down near freezing and calm winds pretty much have all of those in place. Even if you're at 34, 35, still could have a little bit of ice on the windshield as those cooler surfaces again drop down lower than the air temperature here in Tallahassee. No problems. 31 tightened up with radar. Bone dry. Just a blank map for now. So not going to have to worry about rain. Don't need the rain jacket. Don't need the umbrella. You might need it again later on this week, but definitely this weekend. The entire southeast bone dry. That cold front, it did its job. It's down through central Florida now, continuing to work south. Our weather is pretty quiet for today. It's high pressure builds in. So we're seeing sunshine all afternoon. A beautiful forecast tomorrow. A few more clouds start to filter in, and then we start to really warm up through Friday. Up in the mid to upper 70s. Also seeing isolated shower chances Friday. Low chances. The main event, kind of what we're building building up to here is this weekend as cold front pushes through starting Saturday afternoon through the evening. Still rough timing again. We got a few days to keep our eyes on this, but we are looking at some isolated severe potential. The highest threat will be through parts of the deep south. That's going to extend all the way from East Texas into central Alabama, but we also have that threat. We are looking at maybe some damaging wind threat and an isolated tornado threat, something that we're going to know more on as you get closer to the weekend. 64 degrees today, a beautiful afternoon another chilly evening tomorrow. 39, not as cold as we are now. Look at those temperatures after tomorrow morning. Way warmer. Highs are going to be in the mid to upper 70s through the weekend of next week, and those lows only in the 60s. A very mild stretch through mid January.